What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. Hi, folks. How you doing? You know who it is. It's Mr. Warmack, and I'm back in the building. So, and I'm getting cracking with some international news. Uh, this should, you should be concerned about this because it will affect us here in the States. I don't know if it's sooner, if not later. Well, let me let me preface this video by saying, we you know if, as, if you're a Christian or you're Jewish, even if you're Muslim, you kind of know this. In the Bible, it depicts a big brouhaha happening. And it depicts all the nations against Israel. And it depicts Iran, and the Cossacks, which are Russians, against them. And it says once that, once the, uh, once the Iranians and the Russians, I think it's like a couple others, there's a couple others, get together. They're going to come together, and that's when the whole thing's going to kick off. But some things have been happening, like the situation in Syria, when Iran bombed Syria. Remember in, in your Bible passages, it'll say, uh, when Damascus falls, stuff like that, well, here's something which you should be very concerned about. Because I know in Israel, they're, they're on a high alert. Uh, the Russians, the week of, I won't say the week of the 12th to 13th, week of the 12th of April, the Russians confirmed that they're, they're going to redo, they're doing business, so they're opening their business back up with the Iranians. What they're doing is, they're delivering like uh, a couple, they're delivering their S-300 air missiles, which is like an air defense missile system. Now if any of you know what air, air defense missile is, so this, this, just imagine a missile being fired against aircraft, that's all you got to do. Uh, with the, and the Kremlin already has confirmed this. This isn't one of these rumors. This isn't one of my rants. This isn't one of my picking stuff out of a straw hat and saying, this isn't me throwing stuff at the wall, hoping they'll stick. This has been confirmed. And what they're doing is they're trading. Now, get this. They're trading the missiles for oil, Iranian oil. Now, Putin, they had a ban. Uh, I guess they had a five-year ban on Iran. As far as selling stuff, delivery of a missile system, because because what happens now is Israel. You know, Israel was just flying in there and just carpet bombing everybody, and just like, hey, we're going home. Israel has to worry now because Israel can't readily. They can do it, but there's more of a more of a dangerous mission now. They go on Iran. Iran has a missile system. They can pick off the Iranian F whatevers. I'm mean, not the Iranian, the Israel, the Israelite, the, the IDF for short, the Israel Defense uh, Forces. And the deal, the deal problem is like there's sanctions against Iran and like they, that's why the USA isn't too happy with Russia. But if you notice, Russia does a lot of stuff just to piss off America. I mean, he, the Russia wants to be the big player still, even though when, they, when the Soviet Union broke up, they lost a lot of credibility. The ruble was going to the toilet. Uh, but the main problem here is for Israel. Now, a lot of you, a lot of you are supposedly biblical people. A lot of you are supposedly Christians. You guys aren't only Christians on Sunday, but that's beside the point. So I gotta stick to the point. Russia is doing deals with Iran, and Iran is doing deals with a lot of stuff. If you read your, if you if you read your Bible, first of all, you know this is going in the chronological order of what the Bible is saying. Now, as Christians, your duty is to protect Israel. I know, I know that's not real popular nowadays. You guys are worried about you know deviant rights and whatever, and that's another topic I'm going to talk about. But. uh the only problem is with this is this show and prove this is gonna be show and prove pretty soon. Like I think I think it was Ethiopia too. There, there was a couple of, I think German Germany. 
Uh, I think the, I want to say the Turks. Correct me wrong with that. But uh, like a sort of joining together for the big brouhaha at the end of the Bible, the end of days, stuff like that. But, uh, Russia is selling military weapons to the Iranians. How do you know they're not selling them? Not just you. Can, and let me let me be, let me be clear, but you people. Just because you're selling something on a surface, I don't know if it's surface to air, it might be. But just because you're selling something in an air defense system, it doesn't mean you can't blast those missiles depending on the range, just blasting for no good reason and blasting towards Israel. Or, as lately as the Iranians can stand, Saudi Arabia. Which who, who isn't, uh, 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 uh well, how do I put this? Saudi Arabia is not really one of the top Arab countries over there anymore. Everybody's starting to hate Saudi Arabia. You want to know why? Because they pull our strings. I'm just saying. But, uh, you, f you figured Iran gets all these weapons. And they already said they want to blow Israel off the face of the earth. What's Israel supposed to do? How are they supposed to protect their sovereign? You know, it just... To me, it's just, it, it, it just look, the, look, the things to come. I mean, a lot of these people, I, don't, I, and I, I mean, I know I, I talk about religious stuff a lot, but if you look at what I'm saying, it's all in your body. A lot of you religious people need to be, like the preachers know them, right? Because they say, how do you know this? So, and it's twofold. It's, it's, it's what's Iran supposed to do? It's, it's Iran, it's, what's Iran supposed to do? How can Iran protect themselves? If that's where they're really you're getting the missiles. And what's Israel supposed to do? If you already told me you're gonna blow me off the face of the earth, and now you're acquiring weapons to do so, what are we supposed to do? Wait until you decide to blow me off the face of the earth? Or do we or do we be proactive and knock those systems out of play? But if we knock those systems out of play, do they also have an agreement with the Russians? Do the Russians want to put their nose in there? Like I said, you people need to pay attention to this because it's, it's going to affect you. You guys say you're religious, you say you're this, you say you're that, but at the end of the day, you're not. I'm more religious than you guys, and I'm a heathen. So, pay attention to some of this. This, 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 is, this stuff is biblical. So, peace. Come out.